It's Rob! Tony! And I'm Jeff. We're in gaming, and that's you! Hello everybody and welcome back to the end. The final wing of the League Explorers has been released, so we're gonna knock it out. And uh, because we're not in a rush today, we don't have any finals, we have no class today. There's real no reason for a huge rush. Um, normally I release all like the heroic videos first, because that's obviously what you guys want to see. Definitely prior to just the normal runs, because the normal runs, I'm sure, the normal runs, I'm sure you guys, you you knock these out pretty easy. But um, today, you're probably going to be seeing the normal runs before the heroic, uh, just because I'm not in a rush and there's no real need to pump out um, them as quick as possible. So, like always, we'll be playing the Murloc Hunter uh, to start with, and if I can't do it with the Murloc Hunter, then of course we switch off to a deck that is uh, pre-customized and built to the destruction of that specific boss. But for the most part, Murloc Hunter is able to do it. <laughs> Alright, so, because you guys will be seeing this video first, I'm very excited. Because normally I have to, like, speak... Like, never mind. I'm not going to explain that. I'll confuse myself. <laughs> Ooh, a dragon. What does he do? <clears throat> I just called him a dragon dinosaur. Derp. Alright, do we use cold lights here? We'll keep it, just because we have the Tide Hunter. And the Tide Hunter brings out the other Murlocs, which makes it... So this will get at least two cards to give the plus two health. So what is his passive? Give each player a random card, it costs zero. Okay, that's fine. Considering we're playing a rush deck, I'll take any card you give me that costs zero. Random card. Grove Tender. As long as it doesn't give him, like, a... Like a card like that. <laughs> oh, man. That's, that's not good. That's not good at all. Oh, wow. And it gets Death Rattle? Alright, we're just gonna go face. Fuck you. You have a five drop, we got a two drop. It's all good in the hood. We'll summon this shit. Summon this shit. Uh, we'll draw a card since it really doesn't matter if he has like a whole bunch of cards in his hand whatsoever. Um, and we'll swing. Next turn, I wish. Well, depend. I wonder if this gives us a Murloc. You know how great it would be if it gave us like an old Merc guy or something. <laughs> oh no, it gave him a secret. If that's explosive shot, you know how upset I'm gonna be. Kill the two four. Yeah, buddy. Five five to face. Yeah, buddy. Alright, so I guess it really doesn't matter if that's, uh, explosive. Whoa, 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 stop pop. I can't, look at this. I can't even move the card there because the guy's in the way. Look at that. Get the fuck out of my card way. There we go. I want it on the left-hand side, not on the right-hand side. Alright, so we'll swing. Bear trap. Okay, that's fine. We're just going to bring it down to one health. We're going to put down this, no. There's the weapon. Kill that. And then we're going to swing for a three to face. All right, sweet. And then next turn, we're going to, depending on what we draw, I see like a Tide Collar Oracle combo, and then we'll give it plus two attack. Oh my god, another Hunter Secret. What the fuck is up with this guy? Two Hunter Secrets back to back. He gets Toshly, Ancient of War. What is this value this guy is generating? No, I play Web Spinner. You're not a Hunter. Ugh. He's upsetting me with the cards he's playing. All right, so we'll swing for two. Is it an explosive? Another bear trap? No, it's a snipe. Wowzers. Okay, so if it's a snipe, I guess we'll just play the leper gnome, because that's okay to die. Dart trap. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, our field is completely filled with cards, boys. This is fun. We should be able to win next turn, as long as we don't trigger dart trap, which I have no intention to. What did it give me? Shield Slam! It's given me a bunch of useless cards. Like, it's given him a lot of good cards, though. Like, the Ancient of War, the Toshli, and then he was able to deal, uh, two damage to my, uh, Oracle. No, my Tide Caller. Why'd I call it an Oracle? He's killing all my Murlocs, so the mer old Merc guy doesn't get the huge buff. Oh, man, this makes me sad. So, if this is 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, we do not have lethal. That makes me sad. You know what? You're gonna take this shield slim to the face ancient lore. Mmm! Hell yeah. So we're gonna swing for three, swing for two, swing for one. Face is the place, boys. So we should be able to win next turn with our passive and old merc guy. Just by itself. Oh, we should probably use our pass. Oh, gave me a fucking wisp! <laughs> this shit costs zero anyway! That's no value at all! He's gonna kill himself, because he's gonna kill the leper gnomes. But Jesus Christ, game. <laughs> Like, if it was a one drop, at least that's like one point of value. But this is just, that, that's not valuable at all. It fucked me. 
Oh man. Oh man. What bastards. All right, so the next guy was give your hero power can only take one damage at a time. Wow. That's going to be fun. All right, anyway, thank you guys for stopping by the end. I'm Rob, of course, and see you in the next episode. Happy whatever the hell day it is.